Towie star Mick Norcross' £6 million fortune was reportedly wiped by debt following the former Sugar Hut nightclub boss death in January. The 57-year-old's estate was cut to just £42,381 after taxes, debts and other financial matters were sorted it has been discovered. The father of four's finances were revealed in probate files seen by the son and it was also found that the star didn't leave a will, meaning the remaining money goes to his ex-wife Carrie. The star was a fan's favorite on The Only Way is Essex during his time on the hit show between 2011 and 2013. However, he was said to be dealing with money troubles when son Kirk found him hanged in the wine cellar of his home in Essex earlier this year. Shortly after his death, it was reported that Mick had lost out on a large property deal, while records also showed his Willow restaurant and bar had closed with four loans due. He is said to have owed £554,503 to nine creditors, which included over £22,000 in taxes. An inquest into his death heard the former cast member of the reality TV show was found dead by his son Kirk. Essex Live reported from the inquest at the time that Kirk had to make damage to the property to get inside, and CCTV footage of him smashing windows at his dad's home was shown. On the day of his death, Mick was seen on CCTV leaving his office and walking across the courtyard and out of shot at 1. 37 p.m., another camera showed him entering the main residency, and family were seen an hour later, at 2. 46 p.m., looking through the windows. Kirk was seen using a ladder to look in the bedroom window and running past the office, reappearing with what appeared to be a hammer, which he used to force entry by smashing windows. The family entered the pool house at 3. 1 p.m. and emerged minutes later looking upset. The coroner's verdict of death was suicide. In August Kirk shared a heartbreaking message to any of his fans who are struggling. He urged his followers to make the most of their time and told them they were not alone. His voice cracked as he said, this is a message for anyone that's struggling, anyone that feels that they just can't go on no more. You made it this far and no matter how hard times feel, no matter how hard life is hitting you, it will and it does get better. It takes time, days, weeks, years, but look how far you've come now. Doesn't matter how much money you have or what you don't have. Time is something we can't buy, and we can make the most of our time by just being present. If you're struggling and need to talk, the Samaritans operate a free helpline open 24-7 on 116-123. Alternatively, you can email Joe at Samaritans.org or visit their site to find your local branch.